Bozzy Griffin and this is a uh, quick video, I'm going to try and make it as quick as I can, about child abuse and the educational system. When a parent withholds affection from a child when they are in distress, that scars them for life and it affects everything else they do and it rewrites the parameters they have for a caring conscientious adult. When the educational system in a country or even a, an international standard sets core competencies, key criterion for someone's education that dwarfs anything else that student, usually a child, can achieve or portray for their teachers or educators, and there is a difference between the two. When they do that, it robs them of any sense of validation they have for themselves, for their own inherent traits and attributes. And I see this trickling down everywhere. I see it in the job market, when people compete for jobs, throwing qualifications and the like against it, and some people have a lot of experience, and some people have a lot of qualifications. And the worst bit is, as bad and as invalidating to the rest of your life as uh, those things are, it's even worse when you don't know what the real criteria are that people are looking for in a job. I saw, I saw all this come to the surface when I was watching My Kitchen Rules here in Australia and it's just sad. It really is. All of these people hoping and fearing and terribly, terribly upset when they don't receive validation after all their hard work. And all because they're used to living in a system that sets them up in many, many ways to fail. That seems to laugh at us competing for whatever we can get. Get that job. Win that prize. You know, be the best one in the competition. Whatever. We're a society starved for approval and it starts at school. And it's all because some rancid-minded bureaucrat sets key competencies and, and sets up a system that invalidates everything else you can do. Even the communists had streamlining into people's education uh, for the arts or for public speaking or a number of other things. And while I'm not a communist by any stretch of the imagination, at least they had a good point on the streamlining. Anyway, I'm Ozzy Griffin. That is the myth of education. And it is starting, the symptoms of the problem are really starting to show. Have a good one.